Um, yeah, I thought we were really resilient. Um, you know, we found ways to get to the hoop in the second half and to get buckets. But really, I thought our defense showed up really um, big tonight. And I thought Gabby DeMarco played a heck of a game defensively. And um, honestly, we were coming up with rebounds. We were getting stops. And um, I mean, I don't know. Honestly, down the stretch, I just, I think we were feeding it to Hannah and she did an amazing job inside. But I mean, it was just a really resilient and gritty one tonight. The first yeah. half didn't, didn't really go your way. Yeah. Turned over a bit. yeah. Shots. What was the mood like in, in the locker room at halftime? What did you yeah. guys do to kind of write the show? Honestly, it was very calm in here. Um, it was, you know, basketball's a game of runs and we know that. Uh, they, you know, punched us in the mouth in the first half and, uh, you know, we just had to come back and respond. And I thought we did a really good job of that. I mean, we had 12 turnovers in the first half and only four in the second. So uh, we did a really good job of valuing the ball there. You get your nose slammed, mm -hmm. you run off the court, you run back on. I think that just shows your toughness, but also this team's toughness. Mm -hmm. What do you have to say about the team's toughness? Uh, yeah, I mean, honestly, like, I think throughout this tournament, you've seen that we can win games, like low, lower scoring games. I know it was like 70 something, but I mean, that's kind of a low scoring game for us, honestly. And so, that shows a lot of toughness, and I think we've been playing really good defense, and, uh, you know, we've been getting rebounds, and, um, you know, when it comes down to it, we're making big plays, and I thought we did that, and that's just a sign of toughness, I guess. Talk, talk about some of your big plays, mm -hmm. I don't know how you felt about some of those shots yeah. for you, but they look pretty tough. Right? Yeah, yeah, I mean, they weren't easy looks, really, but, I mean, I, I work on those a lot, and, I mean, I, I, I've always worked on that shot, and uh, I was just getting to the rim, and I wasn't, you know, exactly getting layups but I could create some separation I was knocking them down so I was really happy with that. How was, important was Gabby's toughness on defense? Yeah. Backers, doing things that Amazing. Really didn't show up on the yeah. statue. But. Amazing. I mean Gabby does that every single game. I mean she's always guarding the best player and she's got to chase people around and it's not easy at all but um, I think that just shows her mental toughness, her mental fortitude and uh, you know how she's going to do anything to help the team win and uh, she showed up big tonight, had some huge stops and I'm just really proud of her. When you have players like you and Gabby doing a lot of the gritty things, the tough mm -hmm. things, not flashy things. How gratifying is it when something flashy happens, like a big shot, a big three-point shot? Like, yeah, I mean, we're all capable of that. I mean, Sydney's probably one of the grittiest, toughest players on the team, too, so you can't forget about that. But, um, yeah, I mean, I think we're all capable of making shots and making big plays because we've been in these moments before. Um, and so uh, it's not surprising to us. Maybe it is to other people, but not to us. You mentioned that 71 69 is low scoring for you guys. It feels like you've been in more yeah. of those games this year than yeah. compared to years past. Does it feel like that those prior performances early in the year, lower scoring, kind of help in this moment, knowing that you've Yeah, out? for sure. I think, uh, you know, when you have games like that, you have to find other ways yeah. to win, and uh, that might be defensively or, you know, yeah. finding other yeah. ways to score offensively um, or find, you know, who's the hot hand. And so I think we've done a good job of doing that and staying calm. You know, we're not getting frazzled when we're not scoring a couple times in a row or maybe they score a couple times in a row. Uh, we're staying level-headed, and I think that helps from experience. What was Coach Fuller's message to you guys at halftime? Um, honestly, she didn't say too much. I think she just said, like, this is our game. Let's go take it. Uh, she knew that we wanted to get back out there, and uh, she just said, you know, it's about runs, and they went on theirs, so let's go on ours. What was the message between the team, between you guys in the locker room post-game? Post-game? Yeah. Um, good job. Uh, let's go win it all. Uh, we were just really excited and proud of each other. Uh, we didn't really have to say too much. Your next matchup is South Carolina. You've played them before. You've been there before. What is different about this year's transition into this compared to last year? Are your nerves less? Do you guys have more confidence? Um, yeah, I mean, I think we're always really confident in ourselves. Um, you know, if we're not confident in ourselves, then who is going to be confident in us? But um, yeah, I don't know. I, I guess I can't really compare it to last year. Different team, different vibes, but I mean, I know that we're going to do everything we got to do, and we're going to prepare to the best of our ability to help us win.